Kuchitenko. Believe it or not, he's at 0 and 10. He was the winner of the May Sumo Tournament in Ryogoku. He'll be facing Takayasu, who is also struggling here. He's a Maegashira 5 on the west side. He's had... He hasn't had any Ozeki opponents. And he's been struggling to get those wins. Takayasu at 2 and 8. But he had, he's on a two-day winning streak. Let's see how he does against Koktenko. Koktenko getting, looking for the grip. Can't get it at all. Hormoshu is left. He's trying to get it down. Circles around the dojo. It's a merry-go-round. Koktenko just can't get the win this basho yet. Takayasu, not really strong this basho as well. Sorry. Stayed low, he was about to drop down, but Cook Tenko was over the straw bales before that. Takayasu marking his third win, let's see how this went. From the get-go, it wasn't too well for both of them. Cook Tenko trying to get some sort of grip, but he's changed his tactics, trying to slap, him, slap Takayasu down. Doesn't work for both. Takayasu using the harite into Kyoktenho's face there with the right hand. Kyoktenho is too high, can't get any sort of slap down going, and out he goes. <sighs> A push out win for Takayasu. He already has the Makekoshi, 3 and 8. They're trying to get as many wins as possible in the coming, uh, in the last part of the Basho against Tamawashi tomorrow. Kyoktenho, 0 and 11. He's devastated, mentally, but looking for his first win tomorrow against Goedo. This is the Aichi Prefectural Gymnasium. You see the Nobori, the banners here, in hot, steamy Nagoya. It's 35 degrees, almost 90. Oh, 3 nice. degrees Fahrenheit. The humidity is pretty low compared to last week. It was like at 95% last week, but today it's 54%. This is day 12's 